Now, the original of the and uh, this method is very useful in clinical practice. And, uh, now we have a, a brief, brief introduction about the Doin and Chow. Original of the Doin and Chow. Huang Di Li Jing Tai Wei, thousand years ago, we said Huang Di Li Jing said, in the center, the ground is wet, flat. The heaven and the earth produce numerous things, and the people eat various kind of food and do not need to work hard. So their diseases are often atrophy. Yeah, like uh, such as breastfeeding, fainting, cold limbs, coldness, and heat. And the treatment is suitable for them is Doin and Chow. The preparation is DYAQ, therefore, Doin and Chow comes out from the center. So, yeah, this is five method in TCM. So Doin and Chow is one of the and which is acupuncture, herbal, gemstone, and mouth brushing, and Doin and Chow. This five method all included. And the, the Doin and Chow means it's, it's come from the uh, middle of the China. And the environment is very, very good for the people to live in. They have a variety of materials and uh, materials of food and the variety. So the people living an easy life there, they do not need working hard. So they do not need uh, working hard. It's like uh, our modern life. We do not work very hard. So they don't uh, work hard. They don't do a lot of exercises. So they are normally easy to get uh, like uh, disease about uh, atrophy, coldness, and heat. So the treatment is suitable for them to do Doin and Chow. So, Doin and Chow actually is quite suitable for modern people. And uh, nowadays, all over the world, we can eat everywhere the food from all over the world. So, Doin and Chow seems to, um, in that case, it can suitable for modern life, for modern people. And uh, there's uh, a lot of uh, difficulty, diseases, and uh, asthma, and the kidney problems, and the uh, goblet stones can be treated with Doin and Chow. So now we try to introduce the similarities and the difference between Doin and Chow and the other four methods. 
The similarities yeah. is going into the, this five method all based on TCL theories. Dialectic thinking, reading, deduction by the whole diagnostic tactic, etc. Uh, the difference is being shown and medicines about the plant minerals, animals, acupuncture, which is the needle made of bone, gold, silver, steel, monks, bushings, plant, fire. The four methods are all sought out and depend on things out of the body. And doing and cho and is to looking inward without resorting to external things. Only use internal energy and uh, the chi is very important. So we join and cho is use our energy. This is the difference of Doi and Chou with other four methods. Now we try to explain it the representative of the in heritage of Doi and Chou. And uh, there are some very famous figures who were experts of Doi and Chou, and such as Bian Chue and Hua Tuo. During the long history in China, Doi and Chou has been popular in the royal family many times. However, due to several historic incidents, Doi and Chou was hidden in tourism. The last time Doi and Chou appeared in emperor family during the Qing dynasty, Kangxi period. After that, it is hidden after another historic incident. Then it has become a secret method hidden among certain people. My husband, Hu Jingzheng, was a family with children to know the secret method that has never been passed on to other families. The ancestors have secretly passed it on to the eldest son and the eldest grandson. It is the family rule that is passed down only to male and only inside the family. Dr. Fu was the eldest grandson of the family his grandfather loved and valued him very much. He began to study Chinese medicine when he was eight years old. Then the Doyin Anqiu has been passed down to him. In the 1980s, he met Minister Chi Yueli, the former Chinese Minister of Health, and the direct relationship of Mr. Chi. Dr. Fu diagnosed and treated the elder generation of state leaders in China, such as Vice Chairman Peng Jun and others. He also represented the country to treat foreign leaders' medical problems. So this is the photo of Professor Fu Qingzheng and uh, Mr. Cui Yueli, the former Chinese Minister of Health in 1995. And uh, this is a photo of the Professor Fu Qingzheng, one of the former state leader, Vice Chairman Peng Jin in 1995. 
And the Professor Fu is always studying and practice doing Ancho to helping people. And this is a photo of the Professor Fu Qin Zheng and uh, Wang Shou Dao, another state leader. And now we try to introduce the, the present situation of the Doyen HO inherited status. Since 2006, Doyen HO has been taught to German speaking PCM practitioners and the Western medicine doctors. So many Doyen HO practitioners have appeared in Germany. So this is a photo of the, the classes. Can we say, can we see in the photo in the middle, this is the Professor Fu and this is Master Mo, and they're being loved, being admired by their students. And uh, they create the, this is magic method to helping people, which is making all the students was so so interested and in learning to, to helping their patients and the difficult cases and they can they can healing the this the children which have with both have heart problems, they try to use Dodin and Cho to help the children, etc. A lot of difficult cases to help. And uh, there's uh, a lot of Dodin and Cho practitioners appeared in Germany and then we, in 2000, this is the uh, 2018, and Master Mo could be invited by the German students. And uh, this is the uh, Professor Fu's last wish to publish the uh, Doyen Ancho skills. And uh, this is this photo. Is the, Dr. Mo is doing a hand on demonstrations. And this is another photo. And the Master Mo was doing how to, do, how to find the acupoint. point. In 2021, the British traditional Chinese methane airline network organized two sessions of Doyin and Cho classes. The trainee made great contributions helping patients online during the COVID epidemic using Doyin and Cho. Because of its curative effect, it was praised as one finger magic by students and the patients. And uh, the, at the moment, uh, when the two classes was on, the British uh, epidemic very, uh, very critical. A lot of people was in, in have COVID. So uh, we, the training, the students, uh, at the um, instructions, we help a lot of people. And uh, lots lot of Chinese also 
using going until the treating fertility for a lot of difficult uh, cases. And uh, in China, all basic classes and uh, maintenance classes have been held in China. And soon, advanced classes will be organized together with the various special classes and the children's classes. And uh, a lot of parents can benefit from the doing and show, and a lot of children also benefit from doing and show, and they want their children to learn in doing and show as well. So, uh, so all the family want to learn to helping their healthy problems. So this is the photo. Uh, we must more was doing the uh, class in Beijing. And uh, Massimo was demonstrating how to do the, how, how to find the acupuncture correctly. Uh, because the acupuncture in Doing Ancho is uh, some, some of them is uh, different of the traditional uh, acupuncture point. And normally they use the bone. Uh, yeah, and doing ancho and uh, required a very accurate point of the all the acupoints. Accurate, yeah. Uh, so, so now we try to have a, a proper introduction to the doing ancho. <clears throat> doing ancho. It's based on the same principle as the other four methods, like uh, acupuncture, herb, etc. of TCM. Fit the symptoms, fit the general situation, to treat the root cause of the disease, and to bring peace to the mind and the body. The purpose of doing and cure is to treat the existing sickness or preventing further sickness and also to prevent disease and helping to maintain health and promote longevity. The concept of doing and show. And the first we see what's doing. Doing is the gentle press on the acupressure points on the meridian with the middle finger to guide the chi. It's a very, now we must say we know it's a gentle press, not the heavy press. And now we know it's an. An means press. It is pressed gently and continuously on the acupuncture point. Chiao means it's the name of the meridians and the acupuncture point. Yeah, we press on the meridian. And now we, um, you, so we must focus the emperor's, you should be uh, press on it gently, gently, but not heavy. The doing ancho method, the method is to use the middle finger to gently and continue to press on the key point of the meridian. The core of the doing angel is guiding the meridian so as to make it unblocked, balance the chi so as to create inner peace. 
and so as to make the balance qi and the xue, qi and the blood and to make a healthy and longevity the principle of doing and chow uses the finger direction reversal direction of the meridian for reducing while allow the meridian for reinforce the yang meridian can be used to both reduce and reinforce and the yin meridian can only be used to reinforce and not used to reduce and uh, the yin meridian can only be used to reinforce for example the circle points is on the uh, begin testing it's a young meridian and uh, we when we do it uh, the, the finger direction is uh, reversing the direction for reducing why the in reading only for rainforest not to use because most of people the yin always efficiency and sometimes uh, when you reinforce in a way it's a kind of reducing meaning so, So, for example, uh, we can see these two photos, and uh, the finger point, the finger direction along the in reading is reinforced, and the, 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 the below one is the young reading, so the direction is reversed, the young reading, so it's reduced. It's, uh, Reverse the meridian is the small intestine meridian, Hou Xi. And we need to according to the uh, direction of the meridians. The theory of Doyin and Chao is the same as the other four methods of traditional Chinese medicine. And the character the of the Doi Ancho, during the practice of Doi Ancho, you will gather all the feelings, experience, and the clinical experience through one finger. The healing power can be overwhelming. However, some people do not need to feel this power to experience the healing power. It's not everybody. Some people do not need it, but they, they are healed. Yes, they are some people sensitive. They can feel the uh, pulsing, they can feel some difference, they can feel the chi was moving. So that's dependent, depending on individual people. And sometimes say the why today I don't have the feeling another day you feel the feeling sometimes and uh, with you the treatment uh, the, the feeling will be more strong so this depends on individual and the time sometimes some people don't feel things but uh, the the uh, disease being been, uh, been healing. And uh, the second uh, characteristic is into integrate nourishment, prevention, adjustment, and treatment, and can cure both acute and chronic disease, such as the spot, cold and fever, lupus, mental disorders, into etc and also can be performance by joint practitioner 
or by patients themselves and by yourself. Yes. And um, then overall, we can conclude that we only use one finger, the middle finger. Why we use middle finger? Because the middle finger is, is in the middle. We go middle, go moderation. And uh, balance. Zhong, the middle means, means balance. And only our middle finger, the Zhong Chong, Zhong Chong point, can transfer our qi to the patient. And sometimes, Dong Yin and Chiao only use one, two, three. Oh, one, two, five. One, two, three acupoint. And there's no pain and no, no damage. You can self adjustment anytime, anywhere, or by family members. The the joint angel practitioner uses chi of their middle finger to guide the movement of chi in the patient's body by drawing the chi to healing the disease, to regulate the chi in the patient to healing their disease. And uh, now we talk about the the scope of application, and they can treat in a trophy, yeah, and and uh, for example, breathless, fainting, cold limbs, and coldness and heat, to cure the sick, prevent the potential of sickness, and help keep people healthy, and beautiful for all age, especially for infants and the elderly, and also for people who are afraid of acupuncture and other treatments. And also for the elderly, they are very weak and they can't take in acupuncture or other treatments is too strong for them. So use doing and chow to help them very gently, but powerful. And uh, we have helping a lot of people, especially very weak patients and during the COVID-19. And uh, they, uh, they get a very good recover. So, and we talk about the safety of doing and now. Doni Ancho is that the gentle pressing on the patient's meridian and the acupuncture points with a middle finger to cure a disease. The skin is not damaged or stimulated, and the patient feels safe and comfortable. And uh, Where doing angel is not permitted, orthopedics and the serious trauma injuries do not advise to use doing angel directly, and it is recommended to use doing angel as a rehabilitation therapy. So uh, that's very important, and doing angel. It's very good for uh, the uh, trauma and uh, the the bone broken or the injury healing procedure, and uh, that uh, the function the 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 healing procedure is so quick and it's so good. So, 
throwing and jaw and the treating all kinds of injury can speeding up the healing procedure. For future menstrual girl, the use of ring reading a point, like a point, are prohibited. Why? Because when the period come and the can, uh, because the uh, the chi is very big, very strong, so they they can damage, you know, can do some disturbance. And the women during menstruation and the pregnancy do not use the points on the liver and the spleen reading. And also the hergu L14 points prohibited as well. And the, and the joint angle is good for period problems. Um, and now we talk about the, the main prevention, treatment, and the control at point of joint angle for COVID-19. And the uh, COVID-19, the epidemic uh, still, still not settled yet. So uh, some people have cold and the, the people around will be very panicked. And so you, we, when we know about uh, how to do it, it will be very good. And uh, and the most important is to prevent, to prevent the uh, the COVID nineteen. So we can see from the uh, etiology, simple question: the law of acupuncture said, when the five epidemic arrive, they are all mixed with contamination, regardless of all age group and the symptoms are similar. So in thousand years, the Nijing, Huangdi Nijing already talk about what is the epidemic like. And the, in this epidemic, uh, sometimes the whole family have the COVID. So now we talk about the pathogenesis. And the COVID virus ends through the nose and the mouth. And uh, we find the pupil with chi and the yin deficiency are susceptible. The virus enters the body, first infecting the lung. When chi loses its functions, the body fluid liquid and blood will stagnate into flame and then the flame will act obstructing the lungs and cause the pneumonia which make people can't breathe and that's the main reason it will cause people die which is really vicious And, uh, and the other bubble in the lung was being stuck by the flame. And, uh, and now, the, the transmission and the change of the COVID is the virus mainly enters the lung from the nose and the mouth and it's transmitted to the spleen and stomach, middle jaw. After the infection, the liver and the kidneys are damaged and weakened. This is the uh, normal transmission. And then the abnormal transmission is the virus will directly 
attacked the pericardium, and which is uh, some patients will suffer the, the heart problems. So there's a very famous doctor called Zhu Danxi in the history of China, the Chinese medicine history. He wrote a book, talk about how to treat an epidemic. And he say he wrote in his book that the three methods of treating epidemics is it should be supplemented, it should be scattered. It's like a scatter the dampness and get the, 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 the fever, the, the hot. Or it should be extended according to different patients. So now we come to the uh, main point, how to preventing and treatment COVID is Hei Yuan LU9, Hegu LI4, Qi LI11. This is normally for preventing, preventing the uh, COVID-19. Hegu and Qi Qi has a very good uh, function of to reduce the heat fever. And uh, during the treatment, uh, we will the hergu is the main point to reduce the fever, and the taiyuan will be the one to accommodate to helping the hergu to protecting our lungs. And now we come to the taiyuan point. And uh, from the Ling Shu Wen Shu. It belongs to the long reading of hand tai yin and connected to the large intestine reading of hand yang ming. Tai yuan, it is the yuan source point of the long reading and the gather point for vessel. It governs lung qi and regulates respiration. This acupuncture is open the yin shi the period of time from 3 a.m. to 5 a.m. and it is the first to get the key and integrating improving immunity, fitness, and the curing diseases. Taiyuan point indications they can cough, asthma, and other lung diseases. Efficacy they can dis dispersing and descending, invigorating lung and qi. Dispersing means uh, we, we just uh, dispersing the uh, the external the evil from outside. Descending is uh, descending the lung qi to make your breathing better. And uh, the Pei Yuan point can protect in our lung. And the Pei Yuan location, thumb upright on the first horizontal line on the back of the palm, the hollow at the junction of the horizontal lines of the same palm. And uh, we try to look at the doc much more to say, to show us. Yeah. And uh, normally when you put the finger there, you will feel the pulse. And you gently, uh, uh, okay. Wait a minute. Stop here. Make sure. Okay. Uh, 
啊，气的啊，气的，咱们呢就是一定要轻轻的哈，两掌这样的气呢才能够推动哈。大鱼际，上，第一横纹。哦、oh, ，sorry， 上，应该谢尔的 ，sorry。哦，的凹陷处，这有个大的凹陷。你黑呀，两掌，大鱼际，上。Hey Yun Point is a location is palm upright on the first horizontal line on the back of the palm in the hollow at the junction of the horizontal line of the thinner palm. 好，咱们现在呢讲讲合谷穴啊。Now we come to the、uh, 合谷 point. 合谷 is from 灵枢本枢 ，which belongs to the large intestine meridian of Yangming of hand and the connecting the long meridian of Taiyin of hand. It is the Yuan source point of the large intestine meridian. The large intestine meridian, where qi and blood converge, have a powerful qi transformation, and is located in the wide range, which can improve the overall function of the body, and is a very important point for fever reduction. And、uh, during the pandemic, we use、uh, Hegu Li4 to help reduce the fever. It's very, very effective. Hegu point, the indication is for external fever, headache, and cough. And the function is clearing away the heat and dispel the external surface, promoting clearance and descending suavity. The location is the oh. 和第一掌骨之间，那么靠近我们的第第二掌骨，它的脑侧脑侧哈，它的中心点，嗯，中心点，啊，我可以拿一个，忘了拿一个，合谷穴，就是设计给大家，就是说这个掌骨。这是我们的掌骨，它的一半指，食指。Sorry, so okay, this is a this is 合谷，就是手指、食指、食指的掌骨，掌骨的二分之一处。And、uh, the The location is on the back of the hand, between the first and the second metacarpal bones, at the midpoint of the radial side of the second metacarpal bone. On the back of the hand, between the first and the second metacarpal bone. At the middle point of the lateral side of the second metacarpal bone, this is a hergu point, which is slightly different from the traditional hergu point we use when we do acupuncture.
。好，这个合谷穴呢，还有是在月经的女性的月经期哈，还有孕期呢。And the, there's a, a very um, the warning. Women should not use gugu during the pregnancy and the menstruation. So, what we can use? We use qi chi. L one eleven is used instead of gugu points. Qi chi point L one eleven. Qi chi is the PC point of the large intestine meridian of Han Yang Ning. The key point of the meridian and the qi movement is that it can pass from the upper to the lower and it can pass from the inside to the surface. And qi chi is really good. Qi Chi is not as strong as Hegu. And the Qi Chi Xue indication, external fever, sore throat, cough, and the effect, dispelling wind and clearing away the heat and gives external relief. Which L one eleven location is located at the lateral end of the transverse cubital crease, above the transverse cubital crease, in the hollow at the high end of the red radial side.曲池穴，把手曲池穴，把手手肘弯曲，它的肘线的终点和曲肘肘骨的肘骨的顶点和它的中间点。Okay, now we talk about the Qi Chi location. It's located at the lateral end of the transverse cubital crease above the transverse cubital crease in the hollow at the high end of the radial side. And now, and the plus Tai Yuan, and this match group of active points is really good function for, for reduced fever. And um, the function is one in and one yang, one reducing and one reinforcing. First, uh, clearing heat in the large intestines, then nourishing yang yin, which can clear heat and nourish in and enhance one's own immunity. It is one of the best acupuncture groups for the protection, 
prevention and the treatment of lung diseases. And the effect of acupuncture combination, Ergu is a clear heat and detoxify the intestines. Taiyuan is dispersing and descending, nourishing lung qi and yi. And if the lady is the, has the period, we need to change the gu to qi Now we come to the test study, and uh, there's uh, a lot of COVID-19 case study. So now I just uh, talking well. This is um, a, a male, a young male, as uh, 2021 December, is in the New Year's Eve, and. Uh, and after he come back, he become have a fever, stuff nose, runny nose, body aches, forehead pain. And the facial appearance is red face, redness between the eyebrow. Because the uh, confidential, so we can't. We didn't put the photo here. We only put the 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 tone. So his tone was red, pricky, thin, sickness yellow coating. Yeah, this is photo. Yeah, this is his tone photo. And uh, we <clears throat> because he's. Uh, is all over the body aching, so we choose to choose and uh, reducing minus is reducing 65 minutes. And the second consulta consultation is a new year day, symptoms is a sore throat, a slight blood pulse, and the facial appearance, the face reddish and the swollen between the eyebrows subsiding. And uh, the tones red, and the coating becomes thinner, pale yellow. So we use the, the hegu, um, reducing thirty minutes. Tai Yuan, reinforce thirty minutes. And uh, three days later, he's fully recovered. And uh, use Doing Ancho to treat COVID is quite quick and very effective. And now we talk about uh, eating. And uh, eating meat makes the fever re relax. <clears throat> In Huang Di Nei, the cereal fever, the emperor asked, the fever has been cured. But there are always resi residue evils. What is the reason? And Chibor said, Chibor answered, all the residue evils are not cleared because when the fever is severe, the patient eats the wrong diet. Such too much meat, etc. So there's a residual heat left. The emperor asked, What are the contraindications to be nursing the patient with fever? And Chiba said, When the patient's heat potential is slightly weakened, eating meat will cause the fever to relapse. If eating too much, the residual heat will not be exhausted, which should be forbidden. So during the epidemic, much more have treated a lot of COVID-19 people. We find out 
a lot of people, their fever will be relapsed. And then Ms. Mo always asking, have you eaten meat? The answer said yes. So a lot of people have the fever come back. It's because they eat meat, the wrong, the wrong diet. And this, this young man's mom, and his fever is better, but uh, he, she, the, the mom eating the um, chicken, and then he, her, her fever come back. So that is because she eating the, in the meat. So the, uh, the instruction to the patient is very important and they tell them uh, to eat properly, to not eat the meat so so. And this is quite uh, very important to uh, teaching people have a fever and the virus uh, infections. It's not just the one case, a lot of cases have these problems. So this is quite important to we try to point it out to let people to let us know about it. And then we come to the case two. It's a fire burning. This patient suffered fire burning attack, which caused damage to her skin. <clears throat> so cooking some oil. This was the and the, the kitchen was caught fire because he was cooking some oil and he'd been, he'd been attacked by the fire. It was an external damage and not caused by the, any internal deficiency. The skin was red, with blisters, severe pain, many, and also euphoria. Insomnia. We can see the photo. Quite bad. So we use uh, uh, therapies as a fire damage hot. We need to be clear away and the project the heat, cooling the blood and nourish, nourishing the in. The main point is her. So we can see the, uh, this is the before, this is the before doing ancho. If, if she doing ancho, the hergu in the first place, maybe the blister will not come. So this is the hand. And now we, we use the Hegu, Qixi, Yemen, SG2. So this is the main acupoint, Hegu, Qixi, and Yemen, to cool body, easy pain, and help to repair body. And the pitch, the, the match point is Yu Ji, Yin Ling Quan, Hai Yuan. And you see it clears the heat. And the in the recovery state we use we can see in the mid you know after the dawn angel. And this is after the dawn angel. And the swollen and the blisters, and this we use the gu and the tai yuan because tai yuan is the, have the dispersing function. They can helping to yeah during the uh, recovery We can see the at the last the healing, so there's no scar left, no miracle. Yeah, there's no scar left. 
uh, yeah, there's no hand hand picture we can compare, but we can see the whole head. And this is the uh, uh, bell palsy. This is uh, he is a dancer director, and uh, eight years old. And this customer has a facial par paralysis as a result of a stroke caused by uh, Aldo Chiu after he carried out uh, large scale dancing rehearsals. He has had this paralysis for more than a month, which he has not used after other TCM treatment. And uh, so we can see his symptoms. The mouth and the tongue are to the right. The right eyes cannot be closed. And the left corner of the mouth dropped. And his tongue is rightwards, wet, thick, and a greasy coating. Palsy, both side grain pals are strong and big. We can see his photo. We can see his photo. Oh, then, and the why he have this problem because the client has a long-term history of a irregular diet which accumulates the following flame dampness lack of chi and blood also flame fire is a blockage of middle jaw this causes a blockage chi in the middle jaw which leading to fuxi system syndrome so we choose the point of the hugu and the Zhu Sanli, we try to, uh, to, okay. So now we look at this photo. And uh, we use the Hegu Li4 can, can use the fever. We use the hegu on the right side and to reduce the hegu point. And we use the left side, which is the deficient side. We use the two uh, cents. Now we look at the uh, photo, we can see the uh, before the doing angel, his face was uh, the. This is after the one hour the doing angel, and uh, this is a photo is before doing angel and after an hour later. We can see the obviously difference, and with the tone is a difference, and with the face the drop is lifted. So now we come to the case four. It's called a congenital food inversion in children. <clears throat> congenital food inversion in children is caused by the lack of development. The disease is caused by the in balance of yin and qi, which causes the yin reading of the inner ankle of the foot to be too tight. And the yang reading of the outer ankle of the foot to be too loose. So we choose the doing ankle points is KID6, Shenmei, BL62. And so, and Zhaohai is the Yin Chao, and Shenmei is Yang Chao. 
So these two points to help in to congenital photo inversion in children. And the, the point is also on the point where the, the children have the problems. And in the baby, and the very young baby, two or three days can be okay. And if it's a com more complicated, it take a little bit longer. Um, and we can see this photo. Uh, this girl is already in, his, in her 20s. So a little bit late, but we can see, we can see uh, about uh, one month and he is being recovered, she will be recovered. And uh, when, she, when she comes to for the uh, treatment, she's not come for this, but we found it out. And if the parents didn't know she have this problem, so we, we when we found it, we just uh, helping her, and then she uh, she working is much better after treatment. So we now we come to the conclusion. The uh, acupuncture herb bienstone. Long Sebastian and Doyin and Cho, this five treatment method of traditional Chinese medicine and the guidance of the traditional Chinese medicine theory, each method show their power in clinical practice. And they all reach the same goals in different uh, Way. And uh, the Doi Ancho is uh, a nearly lost uh, a pearl. It's very precious. It's a treatment method that does not require the help of an external object. Doi Ancho is becoming familiar and loved by more Chinese medicine practitioners and patients by our public city and the promotion. We have treated a large number of heart to control disease and even incurable disease medically. Because of time limitation, we will introduce this in another time. And thanks again for teacher Xu Bing, Professor Xu Bing, and uh, and thanks for other other teachers uh, inviting. And thanks for listening. If you are interested, you can follow our study group and which are the public account as follows. So this is the WhatsApp group code for going into study. And uh, if you're interested, you can use your finger and uh, to, to do yourself, to try, to try and, uh, and uh, hopefully, and uh, Everybody will be happy and healthy and peaceful. Uh, this is our WeChat official account subscription. So if they like, if you like it, you need to, to see another articles. Thank you. Oh,
那个嗯、呃、声音，那几个穴位，太原、合谷，还有曲池的那个视频。另外，那个朱医生，你把你那个二频二维码再放回一下。Okay. 对，这个是这个毛老师啊、呃，主持一个导演按桥学习班的微信二维码。这个二维码呢，请大家扫描。如果感兴趣的话，因为这个只能接受一百个人。现在我们有一百二十五个人了。如果你你不扫描的话，就需要被人拉进来。现在那个有一个问题啊，有几个问题啊，看一看哈啊，有人问。这个手法要怎么做？毛老师，你方便回答一下吗？呃，手法就是轻轻的啊，轻轻的点按在穴位上就行。嗯，就是每个穴位都是轻轻的点按，不是重。And the method is try to use your middle finger to gently pressing your middle finger gently press on the acupoint point and do not pressing heavy. The middle finger is like a, come from the middle and indicate the balance. So and also we have the chun chun point, the tip of the middle finger, guiding the energy, and and to generating the energy to let our and the chi to to move. 可能他说就是为什么要用中指？嗯，刚才我就是说了为什么。The dogmo masmo is already explained. 请问，谢谢毛老师，请问一下，边边可以治疗吗？嗯，可以的。On the epilepsy and and Douyin Anqiu can also help in epilepsy. And uh, but it may take a little bit longer to heal. And also, you need to be confident. Timing the healing time depending on is a serious or and uh, the doing until and uh, slowly they can. They can reduce the frequency and then stop. And uh, the way to do it is you press on the uh, point and continuously pressing gently. And normally it's a half an hour. Normally, don't uh, ex is not to access 30 minutes only when the emergencies will be more than 30 minutes normally not over 30 minutes and, uh, and, and we need to know Uh, 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 okay, uh, okay. Okay,那取穴是病测还是健测或是双测呢？呃，就是说，如果是呃，这个就是要看了。我们是作为一个，嗯，就是说我们是不是说健测哈，我们是。which side we should do the doyin uh, anqiu. If the, your tongue is go to the right side, 
And uh, if, the, if the tone is on the, on the right side, you need to reduce it on the right side. So the strong side and the deficiency side is, uh, is drop. And normally we will reduce in the strong side, reinforce the deficient side. Yes. Just now the bell palsy patient we reducing the uh wrong side and the reinforce the uh deficient side. When you do your treatment, how can you adjust your qi? And uh, the answer is just uh, breathing normally. And the... Uh, and the point when we do the doing and chow, it's one by one. We normally we normally don't do don't do two points together. They have the one first and another one second. Okay, Okay. Anyway, so the direction of the finger is it depends on the are you in the young reading we needed to reverse the direction and in reading you should be along the, the reading and for the lung cancer problems is it also can be used to 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 help the recover to prevent the disease go worse and to protect our lung. Another question. And after stroke, if the right side is weak, can you? Zhang Hugu 
掌骨的二分之一处。那个半，你要让那个挨着骨头，不压着骨头，赤白肉几处。终点。你要让那个李医生，那个 co-host share screen， 他可能看到，怎么现在看不到他？哎，刚才已经。<咳>他是合谷穴，就是手指、食指、食指的掌骨，掌骨的二分之一处，看不到屏幕哈。挨着骨头，不压着骨头，赤白肉几处。终点。这个这个 share screen 好像看不太清楚。嗯、呃，这样吧，那个朱医生，你再把那个呃这个群这个二维码放一下。OK， 然后大家感兴趣的话，有什么问题在那个群里再继续提问，好不好？好的，好的，行，我来看哈，嗯，行，嗯 ，OK， and which is OK OK， 那你还有什么问题的话，因为时间的关系，我们就不能再回答很多问题。那大家，嗯，就是加这个二维码，在这个群里，你可以给李老师提问，看看毛老师的时间，来回答大家的问题。因为毛老师还有马上就上班了。OK， if anybody want to go to the， 嗯、uh, ，to scan the code to join the group and they can asking much more questions。And、uh, thank you for listening. Thank you very much. Okay. We can we can asking questions in this group. One是那呃珍珠美容，在四月十日，还有一个是尔珍的讲座，是在呃四月三十号和五月七号。啊，欢迎大家参加。那好，谢谢毛老师。感谢朱医生的翻译，感谢毛老师的这些大力支持。那我们有时间再继续呃进行交流。那这次就到此结束。如果有问题，大家加入这个啊导演安桥学习班啊微信群进行进一步的学习。再次感谢毛老师，谢谢。谢谢谢谢谢谢谢谢谢谢 ，Thank you Thank you， 谢谢。今天人人挺多的，喂。非常感谢呃，朱医生的翻译，在在英国已经非常晚了。<笑>嗯，好的，好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的。好的，好的，好的，能听到我说话吗？那个徐老师。Hello。Yes. OK。呃，朱医生，微信群。Thank you. Thank you. 朱医生，你要你要说，就是 Chinese， 然后他就可以听到了。哦、oh, ，我我找不到，我找不到了，我。我现在是在中文吗？现在大家都退了，啊，那没关系了。现在对，呃，现在能能听到我说话吗？听到，听到，听到了。我听到了，哈。今天还不错，还不错。我没想到还能还能跟得上，有有有一点点卡壳，有的时候。啊，没关系了，因为那个呃，外外国学生不是很多，大部分都是嗯、呃、那个讲中文的学生，所以说还是非常感谢你。好好好，那还非常好。好的，好的。也非常感谢，然后感谢那个，那我们就是在在那个微信群里再继续交流，看看进一步怎么学习下一步哈。好的，好的，行，我们再商量，再议。对，嗯，好的。哎，你看，你看看那个群里现在有有人加入吗？呃，一共有五十几个加入进来了。哦，已经五十几个，多的。那不错。嗯。然后就是，呃，毛老师可以这样，你在那个大群里适当的放一些录像啊，一些病例
，然后看看大家。那阿香姐，阿香姐到时候可以发一点，那个我们的公众号什么的哈。啊，可以的，可以的。嗯，那我来发吧。嗯，他他在他在群里吗？呃，我待会进去，我待会进去。我来，我来，我来邀他，我来邀。对，进来以后呢，你可以把公众号的一些信息、一些文章，呃，一些比较就用户比较感兴趣的，就学员比较感兴趣的一些内容呢，转发到群里面，阅读量高了以后呢，转发自然就高了嘛。嗯，好的，好的。对，因为看看大家有什么。阿香姐，阿香姐，你我已经邀你了，你进了吗？现在六十三个人了。嗯，好的，好的，我一会儿。好的，一会儿，你可以，呃，提醒大家，如果大家对什么特殊的疾病有要求，那可以提出来，这样的话，我们可以有针对性的来帮大家解决，怎么，啊、呃，组织一个学学习，是不是、啊？这样的话更有针对性，根、嗯、据大家要求，是不是、啊？哎，我当时在讲课的时候，我的我的能看到我的像吗？还是只是看到毛老师像吧？可以看，都可以看到。呃，看看到都两个都可以看到的，我设了两位的视频是在放在首位的。哦哦哦哦哦，好的哦。那那位是这样，你可以把那个你们那个那个录像，我不知道录的是什么，我来看一看哈。对，你可以放个回放。